everyone! I hope you are doing well, and I know it's been so, so long since I've come on to do a Dollar Tree haul. So I wanted to come on and say hello, and also to do a huge collective haul that's from, I would say, probably the month of March. Um, so over a month and a half almost, so this is definitely going to be a huge one. I'm going to try to fit it all in one video, but if it does get too long, I'll do a part two of this um, haul. Uh, but I do apologize for not being on for a while. It's been, life's been busy. Uh, Work-wise, I did uh, get a promotion, so I'm very, very excited. But of course, when you start a new role, of course, you do a lot of training and it's a lot of information overload. So when I get home, I'm just so, so tired. So I want to thank you all for those who have um, left me messages, who have um, showed your support and continue to stay subscribed to my channel. I appreciate it so, so much. Um, also, for those of you who are interested, I am finally on Instagram. I joined uh, not too long ago. But it's more of a personal account, so I have both my friends who are um, friends and family that are not on YouTube, and so it's not going to be just haul stuff, it's going to be more of a, my personal life, my travel adventures, food adventures, so for anyone who's interested, um, please uh, follow me on Instagram, it's animalbeal123. So again, at animalbill123, I'm going to leave it down um, below, but I uh, hope you guys can uh, join me so that we can um, keep in touch. But anyway, enough rambling. Um, I wanted to say hello and um, share with you guys what I got. I'm going to start with the food items just because I want to put them away. There's so much awesome food finds right now at Dollar Tree. I'm sure most of you have seen these um, before, but I took this out of the freezer because I did get two of these. This is the Tony's Pepperoni Pizza. Now this is huge. It's not those personal ones that uh, we have seen. This is a pretty, pretty good size. Um, It's 18.56 ounces. So if you were to get this at like Target or other supermarkets, I think it range, probably the price ranges from four to six dollars a piece. So for a dollar, can't beat it. I got two boxes. I haven't tried it yet, but for any of you who have tried it, let me know. Leave a comment below if it's good. But I think for just the price of it for a dollar, totally worth it. Um, I also picked up some of these uh, Keebler Club Bites. I was so excited to find these because these are great for snacks. Each box comes in a pack of three. So I did get, I think, three boxes of each. So I got three of the one in the peanut butter, and then they also have it in the cheese as well. Um, great for the kids, great for yourself if you love peanut butter uh, or cheese like I do. These are awesome. So uh, I was definitely excited with the food finds. I also found these. These are the Kellogg Special K snack bars and they had a couple to choose from but I went ahead and uh, got this one this is the uh, salted pretzel chocolate and they're a hundred calories each so not too bad so I got that one it comes in a pack of is it six bars yeah it looks like it's six bars and then this one right here is the salted caramel chocolate the other special K that I got was this one, which is the Pastry Crisp in Red Velvet. Yum! I can't wait to try these. I mean, how awesome to find these at uh, the Dollar Tree. I have a coworker who, um, during our break, sometimes she wants to go to Walgreens to buy these um, breakfast bars because she doesn't eat breakfast sometimes. And she pays like 3 to $4 for a box of these at Walgreens. And I'm like, oh my God, next time I go to Dollar Tree, let me help you pick some of these um, up <laughs> because they're just a dollar there. Another awesome find were these. These are the Kashi Chocolate Almond Butter Soft Baked Cookies. I'm excited to try this this comes in a box with eight cookies 10 grams of whole grain uh, and three grams of fiber so this is definitely a healthy snack uh, alternative so another great find at the Dollar Tree I was also um, very curious to try these as well they had a bunch of these Snyder's um, pretzels and these are the pretzel poppers airy and crunchy pretzel shells I'm not too much of a pretzel person um, but because this one has the uh, the shell uh, I think it's easier to <laughs> chew on and it doesn't uh, shouldn't be too dry hopefully but it is uh, they said guilt-free and low fat 120 calories per serving so I just got the original and definitely want to give that a try. Another one that I was excited to find was this one. This is the 7-Day Pizzetti 
Um, it looks like those uh, bagels, those crunchy bagels, but I got this one. They had different flavors. This one has the tomato and olive. I love olive oil. So I really wanted to give this one a try. It looks like a pretty healthy uh, snack. So again, a dollar can't beat that. Another snack that I got was this one. This is the Mrs. Freshly's uh, Mini Donuts. And I love these because these are wrapped in um, packs of, I think there's like four packages. Yeah, four individually wrapped four packs. So you can keep them fresh and just take a pack at a time for snacks. These are definitely yummy. I was excited to find that. And then the last snack item I got was this. It's the Sherwood Nut Clusters. This is the peanut, pumpkin seed, and blueberries. Uh, clusters. I've never tried this, but uh, I thought that this was a great snack as well. As you guys can see, I have definitely a lot of snacks to bring to uh, work. But again, definitely check the food section at Dollar Tree. They really have some awesome stuff right now. All right, you guys, the rest of the haul will consist of the other things that I found. It's a little of everything, so I do apologize if it's going to be in random uh, order because I got so much stuff. But anyway, I am excited. The Bolero stuff are back in the stores. It was kind of limited. It wasn't a lot of stuff. Uh, my favorite items are definitely the facial wipes. That's why you see I stocked up on a lot of facial wipes, use it every single day. Uh, now with the amount of wipes that I got, this should last me at least half a year. Uh, because I think there's like 30 in a pack. Yeah, 30, 30 count um, packs. But uh, look at these soaps. Um, I've used these before and each bar, they're huge and they smell really nice. So I did pick up the bath soaps. This is in the lemon, verbena and mint. This is in the coconut uh, milk and mango. And this is in the argan and shea butter. So I love the bath soaps, love the facial wipes. I found four in the lavender and chamomile and then one in the coconut milk and mango. And I also got one of this uh, body wash in the coconut milk and mango. The only thing that I still want to find in the Bolero, if they have it in stores again, are the hand creams. I love the hand creams, but I haven't seen any store get more of the hand creams in. They did get a lot of the body creams, which I'm tempted to get and use it as the hand cream. I'm not sure how that would work, but again, I'm looking for the hand creams, but I was so excited that these Bolero items are back in the store. These are awesome for just a dollar each. And if I see more of these facial wipes, I'm probably going to pick up more of those as well. Uh, I didn't pick up a lot of beauty items, but I did find this. This is the Fashion Nails, fun and easy to apply. And I love the watermelon um, prints. Now I don't do my nails that often. And when I do it, I don't think I'm going to put it on all of my fingers. These are more of the accent nails, but I thought when summer comes up, these would be fun to use. And then I also found these Revlon uh, scented nail polishes. And these are super fun, but I didn't want to go crazy again with these nail products. So I only got two. I got this kind of like bright red one right here. I don't know if it has, oh, this one is called Ginger Melon. And then the other one that I thought was really pretty was kind of this um, almost like lavender and gray combination. They call it lavender soap. So those were the only two. I know some um, people hauled a bunch of these, but again, I'm trying to be good and not get too much of those. So I found those items there. And then I also picked up this dial hand soap and this is a seasonal one. It's a limited edition and it's in the iced berries scent. So I was happy to find that. I also picked up one more bar of soap. This is in the Sugar Soap Works and the Oatmeal and Lavender scent. These are also huge as well, like the Bolero ones. So whenever I see these, I try to pick them up. Okay, some random finds. They had these little trinket trays near the register. They had a bunch of them, but I decided to only get one. This one says Fearless. And I thought, not only is this good for jewelry, I mean, it's kind of small for jewelry, but it might make even a cute little soap dish as well because my bathroom down here, downstairs, it's uh, kind of in the purple color theme so I thought that one would be good to uh, put in there and then I also got these little um, bags these are the fruit ones 
and I'm sure you guys have seen them before they were at the registers but I got it in the orange and the watermelon just great to carry around um, especially since in a lot of cities and states right now they ban the paper bags so it's great to have these on hand and they're so so cute as well okay they had a bunch of new stationery at the stores you guys Dollar Tree has really been stepping up on their craft items and stationery items so they had these deco tape back in the stores and there were three designs so there's this set right here you'll see that they're the thin washi tape or deco tape as they call it these are great especially for planners so there's this design there's this one right here this is probably my favorite one look at the fun colors that they have and just for a dollar a set and then here's the other one right here I love the one with the hearts and then I only got one of this these are the coloring ones and I got this one with the flowers there were like three or four designs but again I only got one of that one I also got some ribbons now they had these ones which are kind of like a almost like a rainbow effect or like tie-dye effect so you'll see that there's this color combination right here there's also this one right here so they're a little different ones like more of the green and then ones like the blue these are so pretty and then I got another pack of these I picked up these before this is kind of like the iridescent uh, sequins ones I also got this jar of the buttons these are great for crafting I thought just for a dollar why not a lot of different colors, a lot of different uh, sizes. I also picked up some candles, you guys. So they had a bunch of new candles. I've never seen these ones before, not that I know of, but look, it has two weeks. And then this is in the um, rose water scent. The other one that I got is in the lavender scent. And then of course I had to get the coffee looking like candles. So I found this one, the Candle Cafe Frap. This is in the white chocolate frappe. Look how cute the packaging is. And then the other one is this one, the salted caramel frappe. And there was one more, but I only got two of them. So I was excited to find those new candles. I also got some blind bags, you guys. Finally, these came to my store. These are the My Little Pony Friendship Magic Collection. So I'm going to give these to my nieces to have them open. They only had three packs left, so I got three packs of those. They were so hard to find in my store, but I was excited for those. You guys, Dollar Tree is definitely stepping it up with their things. Look how cute these body lotions and lip glosses are. I just had to get one of each because I'm going to not only use them as for the body lotion and lip gloss purposes, but I will definitely keep them as um, kind of like a collectible item and display them. Don't they kind of look like nested dolls in a way? But I got one of every color that they had. I was looking for these for weeks and finally they came. I just had to get them and in fact I got an extra one of the body lotion and I just put it at my de uh, on my work desk and so many people have asked me what is it it is so cute I used to have one of these lip glosses that I got from forever 21 and I think it was like 3.99 or something like that so for a dollar each can't beat it um, also makes great maybe bridal shower favors or uh, party favors they are just super super fun so I was and you guys know I like owls, so I just had to get them. And again, I will line them up and display them once I'm uh, done using them. Or as I'm even using them, I'm going to display them as well. Some other exciting finds at my store. I found these uh, Rimmel lip balms. And these are the Keep Calm and Lip Balm line. And this one says Keep Calm and Shop super cute I actually saw these at Walmart and picked them up before too but for a dollar you can't beat it I got this one it says keep calm and party and then I also got this one this is the keep calm what does it say keep calm and kiss very pretty I love the color combination of those so aren't you 
excited that Dollar Tree has these items? I sure am. And that's why it is so addictive going there because there's new surprises every week of things that we never expected to find at the Dollar Tree. Another exciting find for me, this was near the registers where they have random items. You know how sometimes they have like those comic books and these uh, collectible stuff? Well, I'm a huge Beauty and the Beast fan. I went and watched it like Thursday night that weekend that it came out. But this is pretty cool though. This is for me. This is the Enchanted sticker album. And it has the cover with, uh, with one of the movie scenes. Isn't that so, so cute? And you're supposed to collect the different stickers and put them in and of course I probably won't get all of the stickers I might put my own stuff in there but I did get 10 packs of these stickers with it so these are the uh, album stickers and they come 10 in a pack so yeah I got 10 of those these were an exciting find I haven't done something like this in a while like collecting stickers and putting it together but because I'm a huge Beauty and the Beast fan I just had to get that so I got that I also found these cell phone cases now I rarely pick up cell phone cases from the Dollar Tree but these are awesome because this first of all this fits my phone it's for the iPhone 7 plus um, I'm still very much in love with my current iPhone case right now which has the uh, the glitter and it floats around with the watery liquid inside but these are cool you guys for just a dollar it definitely um, is is worth it so it's the metallic kind and this is like in the rose gold color so you'll see that one and then I also picked up one in the silver as well so again since they have it in these different colors sorry I don't want to blind you guys but um, these are like uh, it has that mirror metallic effect again it fits to the iPhone 7 so I'm super glad that they've come out with these cases that actually fit the new phones um, nothing special I needed some reusable gloves so I went ahead and got a pack of that I also picked up some station some more stationary items now this folder is super cute it has that very nice watercolor effect but it has all the famous landmarks throughout the world of course you guys see the Paris Eiffel Tower and it says it's not the destination it's the journey so very very cute for just a dollar of course I also picked up some new stickers. I'm sure you guys have seen these before. They don't have too much new stickers at the Dollar Tree right now, but this is probably the prettiest line that has come out recently with the floral designs. So there's that one. And then there's this one, the stickers. Uh, and, and I guess uh, these are, you see the, how it has the word spring, but it's made up of the flowers, super cute. And then look at this one the life and then this one's really pretty I really love the bicycle love that and then there's this one that says love also very pretty and then there's this one so I think I got one of each of the designs very pretty flowers I love the color combinations of those and then these were also new at the store these are pretty cool these are the scented felt tip pens the color sense and they have different colors they have the red the green the blue and the orange and I believe there's this set too which is the purple and the black let me know for those of you who have gotten it and tried it let me know how those work because I was excited to find that and then they had these new push pins. I love the colors of these. And what's great is that uh, you, you can pin it first of all, but it also has the little hook. So I'm going to bring these to work because sometimes I want to hang multiple pages of documents. And how cool would it be to use these and then um, just hang the hole punch and hang the documents off of that. Fun colors as well. And then they also had these, but I only got two. There were, I think, four or five designs, but these were the only two that I like. These are the dry erase dots. So kind of interesting, but look how pretty the colors are. Got those. And then I also got these. Uh, they had these packs of holographic sheets. I mean, awesome for 20 sheets for a dollar. So they have these ones, and they come in different colors. Very pretty. And then they have the foil. One. So this one is the one in the gold and the silver. So again, these are 20 packs each. 
super awesome. Great for different projects. I also picked up these. These are the Milestone prop sets. So I got this one. I'm going to give these to my, to my niece. This would be perfect for her. Great for different photo shoots. And then speaking about the nieces, I also picked up these. This is the camera viewer. It's really cool because when you look through it, you see different images. So these are the different images that they could see. I thought that was really fun. So I got the Disney princess one. The other one that I got was the Minnie Mouse one. And then here are the different images that you can see. They have some really awesome toys right now at Dollar Tree. I mean, they're stepping up in all departments. Pretty much everything. And then speaking about Minnie Mouse, look what I found. This is super cool. This is a digital thermometer. Now, since my parents are helping to babysit my youngest niece right now, it's great to have these on hand, especially, I mean, hopefully not, but if kids ever uh, end up with a fever, these are great um, tool to use. And I know if you were to buy this at Walgreens or other drugstores, it's probably over $10. So to find a Minnie Mouse one, how cute, right? So I was excited with that find. Now I also found this, I don't know why in that one store they put it in the stationery section, but I think it's actually for the pet section because this is for the, it's the Crazy Claws Shiny Puffs, fun and flashy for all cats. And before I was like, why in the world did they put it in the stationery section? But at the same time looking at it, I could probably do a DIY with this and maybe make it kind of like a uh, charm for the planner because it is super fun. It's like a pom-pom uh, shape and it's in the metallic pink and teal color. So that's what I got this for. This is, I don't have a cat, so <laughs> I have no purpose for that other than um, to use it as a, from a decorative standpoint. Um, another fun toy, this is the actual Etch-A-Sketch, you guys. It's not the Dollar Tree brand. So this is really cute. It's like the mini uh, version of it. So when we go on road trips, this would be fun for the kids to keep occupied. Another cool find for the kids are these uh, paper to digital coloring pack and I guess you could use it for the iPad digital crayon inside 32 paper to digital coloring pages it helps to de develop fine motor skills and improve hand eye coordination so I got the one that's the my little pony and then for the boys uh, the Hot Wheels one again great deal for just a dollar each I have a few more items that I wanted to share with you all before I end this haul. I'm definitely going to need to do a part two, but a couple of other items that I wanted to share and put in this haul was I found this roll of gift wrap and the, uh, of course, the gift wrap section for the wedding theme. Now, Dollar Tree, before I really didn't feel they had a good selection of the wedding uh, gift wraps, but they did have this one and I really love it because of the color combination, the hearts, they have some polka dots on the hearts, uh, they have the floral and it's like the pink and teal with the silver combination. I loved that and I wish I found this when I went to my friend's wedding last um, October but how pretty is that? I also got some of these gift bags and these are gorgeous. These are the mini ones but it comes in different colors. I got the teal one but they also had it I want to say in purple and pink as well and it has these gold foil prints on it. So there's this one and there's this one with the polka dots and then one with the stripes uh, and again it comes in a three pack. I also found these cute little pom-pom keychains. These have come out in, at the Dollar Tree before, but not in these colors. So I was excited to see it in these color combinations. I only picked up two. I got the one with the lavender color, and then of course this pretty um, teal color one. Very, very nice for just a dollar, of course. It, and it's just, I know I've seen them for three or four dollars at other stores, so I just had to get those. I got the paper clips, and these are such pretty colors. Uh, it comes in an 80 count pack, so these are the bigger ones. I also got the smaller ones as well, which are in 250 count ones. And they had a lot in that line, but I didn't pick up anything else. I only wanted the paper clips. They also had some new uh, sticky notes, which are perfect for my planner. Uh, this one, it says stay kind and honest and it has these really pretty rose prints on it. 
this one I probably wouldn't have gotten it if it wasn't for the shape of it but I really like how it's like the flag shape and it says stop wishing start doing and then the last one that I got was uh, Say Yes to Adventure. I thought before these were flowers, but they're actually succulents. Look how cute that is. So I got that, and each of them are in a pack of 100. So great deal on that. I also got some magnets, and these were the ones that I picked up. This one says, Do Donut Worry, Be Happy. How cute with the pink and the sprinkles. And then this one's very pretty as well. It says, The love of a family makes life beautiful. It has that gold foil, has that um, mint green color with the beautiful floral designs. So I got those ones. They have so many different magnets, but I only stuck to those two. Another item that I got was the were these Jot sticker notes. So these are also sticky notes, but look how fun the cutout is. It says to do, um, urgent, and approve. I'm not really sure why they use approve. I would have preferred something else. But anyway, nice colors, great uh, value, 150 of them. And I just really, really like the colors. Another fun find were these emoji hand sanitizers. I love these. These are so cute. They had, I think, four different designs, but I only picked up these two. I got one in the cotton candy scent and then the other one in the cupcake scent. Another pack of stickers that I found were also in the Jot brand, and they had different pr designs of these, but I only got one. I only got the unicorns one because I am currently obsessed with unicorns. So there, it comes with the puffy set here and then this holographic one and then there's these ones these are like the regular ones but very pretty doesn't it remind you of Lisa Frank so this is a great value for um, for a buck right why not and then it's almost Easter of course so I got these salt and pepper shakers they also had it in the bunny but I also uh, but I got a bunny set last year already but these chicks are so cute these little chicks and they actually match the ones that I got from Daiso last year which are also like uh, different condiment holders and it's also in the chick design they are so cute so I'm going I'm definitely going to use these and I feel like this is something that I can use past uh, Easter as well I also got this new um, mirror. Now, I had a mirror like this before, and I don't know what happened to it, so um, I went ahead and got one. So I'm not going to flip it over. Obviously, it's a mirror, but um, it's very, very pretty. It has this uh, antique feel to it. I also got these laser poster stickers, and they had different colors, of course, but I got it in the gold color. And then last but not least that I wanted to share in this part one of the haul were these, uh, was this reusable totes. Isn't this so, so cute? Perfect for the summer. I love the lemon print on it and the jar of lemonade. Very, very fun. So front and back is the same. And then look at the sides. Look at the print right here. I want to make sure you guys can see it. So it also has these different fruits slices on it isn't this so cute so they had different designs but i went ahead and uh just got this one right here so that is my part one of my dollar tree haul i know this is a lot of items and i still have more you guys but i definitely want to share the rest with you all um as well but hope you all enjoyed this and i like i said i just have to say how excited i am with all these awesome things that we are finding at the dollar tree right now and thank you so so much for watching again i appreciate all of your love and support and don't forget to follow me on instagram you guys animalbeal123 um on instagram uh and again it's not just gonna be haul items or dollar tree items it's more of my personal <laughs> life or anyone who uh is interested and and uh you know i can definitely follow you back on it as well uh if you have instagram and uh, want to keep in touch but anyway thank you so so much for watching i will be back soon with part two of my dollar tree haul bye